Do you wear wigs? Uh, no, I do not. Have you worn wigs? No, I have not. Will you wear wigs? <laughs> when will you wear wigs? When will I wear wigs? Right now, baby. Right now, in today's video. Hello you guys, James Charles here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you can see, okay, I look a little bit different than normal. This morning I woke up, hopped out of the shower and kept my hair exactly as it looks like. This is my God-given hair. The hair birthed by Christy B herself. Ew, sorry mom, love you. <laughs> As you guys know, if you've been following me for a while, okay, it is no secret that I love to dress up. I'm always in some crazy outfits, trying out different hairstyles. What is that? And one of the ways that I love doing a true transformation is a wig. Wig, I feel that already. Wig, okay. Wig, I feel that already. I love a good wig. I think they are so fun and fascinating to me, especially because I hate my hair. You guys know this. I've had a struggle with it over the years. Okay, there's a reason why I've had the same bird's nest hairstyle for the last six years on YouTube because I just don't know what other haircut would suit me. Sometimes I debate buzzing it all off and then I remember I need to buy a trip to Turkey to get a hairline transplant before ever doing that. So one great way to fix it is wearing a good old wig. We've done a full day of wearing the world's longest nails. We've done a full day of wearing the world's longest heels. We've even done a full day of wearing the world's longest lashes. And now today, if you could not guess, it's going to be a full day of wearing the world's longest wig. If you're excited for another episode in this ridiculous series of embarrassing myself, please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up down below. Click that subscribe button if you have not already. And on that note, let's head into our rig room. Our oh. <laughs> Let's head into our wig room. That is the gayest sentence you could literally ever say. Okay, you guys, so for today's video, we're gonna work our way up because as I said, we have many variations of wigs. So let me just show you the extensive collection that I have obtained, okay? I want you guys to take a guess at how much this wig wall actually costs because when I posted videos in wigs previously, people were always shocked when they hear the prices of human hair wigs. Spoiler alert, it's expensive. This row alone of these, our nice little ombre, is probably over $10,000. Jesus. I know. Human hair wigs are really expensive, but we have synthetics on this row, which are like my drag wigs. These are not as expensive. These are like 300 a pop. Sometimes 400, sometimes 500, depending, but these aren't too bad. That's synthetic, that's fake. We have a good little mixture up in here of some wigs. This is a guinea pig. <laughs> Roadkill. This right here. Is Diners driving to die? Will I take you out of America to the best? This is Guy Fieri is what this is. So what possessed you? I always wanted to get a buzz cut, but I'm self-aware and I know that my hairline is ugly. As I just said, I've heavily researched a trip to Turkey to fix it. I hate it and I wanted to do a buzz cut and I looked into doing a buzz cut for myself because when you get a hairline transplant they shave your head so I was like I need to see what I would look like with a buzz cut on and I just came across this man on my for you page named Dylan Hasselbank and he makes men's wigs which is so cool to me because I never thought about it that way obviously I have lots of really puff wigs to you know do drag and fun little cosplay but I don't have any men's wigs and I was like oh my god that's a fun way to switch up my style without making a permanent change so I ordered this from his website that's the one you chose. It's also not a buzz really? cut. It's not great. Um. <laughs> Wig. <laughs> Wig, okay. It's not giving what I think should be gay. What's wrong with it? Uh, where should I start? <laughs> the length is a little crazy. The shape Whoa. is a little crazy. The color is a little crazy. Well, fuck my drag. <laughs> fuck my drag, right? Did I fucking cut my hair? No, you didn't. It's a fucking wig. I literally, I can see it on the sides. Oh my god, not clocking the lace. You look like Kathy from Candy Apples. <laughs> Do you think this is giving for me? Do we like? No. Huh? <laughs> really? I would be a horrible friend if I said yes. <laughs> that's real. That's yeah. that's real of you. But wait, can you try on Mrs. Curls behind you? God, we're taking personal requests now. No. I was no. that girl. I did some bad things. <laughs> Okay, bye. Uh, <laughs> Michael, I cut my hair. No, you did not. <gasps> yeah, I cut my hair. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Yo, it is not a look, fucking ice ice wanna be looking ass motherfucker. Michael! It's giving Oompa Loompa. Oh, Oompa Loompa? It's giving, I, I need help. It's giving, I am not getting enough attention. It's giving <laughs> a lot of things. Oh my God, and read me. If you ever need someone to be honest, I guess you just call this FaceTime. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. Mom, I cut my hair. Oh my, let me get my glasses on. You not only 
You colored it too. Yeah, I got. I just needed something different. It looks. <laughs> it looks. <laughs> it looks. It definitely looks. It's giving um, like Billy Idol looks. Billy Eilish. No. No. Sorry, I'm not born in 1854. Yeah, he's like he was like a rock star back in the day. Do I look good? Oh, it, it does look good. <laughs> That's like awesome. Good. <laughs> hey, hey, did you eat your Easter cookies? I haven't opened the box yet. I haven't had time. Okay, bye. Okay. <laughs> Should I call my dad? Give Dickinson's up. What the fuck? That oh my god, that's so funny. Ever. Dad, I cut my. What the fuck? <laughs> I cut my hair. You fucked up. <laughs> what? You think? We don't like it? That's not really your hair. It is. Oh, wow. You got to get yourself one of those big red clown noses. <laughs> You're all Dad! You think it's that bad? I think it's fucking hideous. <laughs> You're going to have to plan on staying inside for a good six months. <laughs> Tell me that's not your real hair. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, fucking thank God. <laughs> I think it's giving. Yeah, it's giving all right. It's giving me a headache. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's safe to say that um, no one's a fan of my wig. You're very honest, friends. Well, thank God. I would be sad if I called anybody and anybody told me that this looked good. So I, at least I have good people in my life that are keeping it real. Let's move on to the next wigs. Now, this one, I actually didn't even order at all. This was a surprise added to my cart, which thank you so much, love that. I think this is a mullet, so I am so scared to see this. Wow, this looks like literally my hair. Okay, hold on. It's giving like modern mullet. Like imagine if I had a mustache and a tote bag, the girls would gag. <laughs> Which girls? <laughs> Me. <laughs> girls. No. Wow. Who is that? I literally look like fucking Orphan Annie. Okay, it's the first time you picked up a broom, or? It's a hard knock life for us! It's a hard knock life for us! <laughs> Give me more Miss Hannigan. <laughs> Serving, um... Serving sandwiches. <laughs> At a deli. This is like, it's not that bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're saying I have to show that much forehead? Right. Well, you have the fucking hairline. Like this guy fucking scammed you. No, you look so good in the way. Look at these wigs! These, yeah, exactly! He looks good in them on his own page. He scammed the fuck out of you. Yeah, I just wanted to be free from my long hair, so. <laughs> I'm living my new life. Like, Let's go dancing, honey! <laughs> One of them seems to have gone missing on the wall there. Oh, there it went. Oh my god. Oh my god. You look like one of those large Swedish men. You know, like with the really long hair. I did not spend $2,000 on this thing so to be called a large Swedish man. This is giving tiny. Who? <laughs> tiny Los Angeles girly. Oof. Tiny lavender matcha, please. Oh god. Okay, so that's wig number one. That one's a little like money piece. Love her. She's a good one. This is the one that Dave Portnoy mistook me for Madison Beer in. Oh, I know her. Madison Beer. I just, that's, <laughs> nope, that is James Charles. Shut up. Clearly doing something right here. That was like that scene in the ring. You have something nice. This one's so pretty. It really goes well with your dark features. That does look less Nordic than the last one. <laughs> less Nordic is crazy. Like, that's pretty. Somewhere in between Madison Beer and Ozzy Osbourne. That's <laughs> where. <laughs> oh my God, come on, you guys. This reminds me of like, 2017 pumpkin spice latte ordering like white girls when every single bitch on planet earth is getting ombre hair it's pretty so pretty i really love your hunter camo underneath yeah the shirt is really throwing me off i feel like the wigs are also pretty but i'm giving like man also i'm sick which is not helping either you know what we do still have our longest wig but that's the whole point of today's video obviously so i'm gonna go ahead and change my top put on a little bit of glam that way by the time that like i put on the longest wig it's not giving large scandinavian man Lewis claimed. Hold on. Oh, look at that nose contour. That is pinched. Tiny. Okay. I'm so pretty. Okay. It's time to get wigified. So glam is done. I haven't even like seen this wig yet. I'm so scared. Bitch, I better look pretty because I did not get all this glamour on. Oh my god! Ew! Why does it look like the fucking, this looks like the fucking girl from the ring. Oh my god. 
There's a lot of room to work. There's not even a fucking lace on it. How much does this wig cost? 40, 60. $60? Oh, that's a bargain. This is like fucking, oh my God, it's so heavy. <sighs> this is like a fucking horse tail. Giddy up, girl. What the fuck? Ew, wait, the fucking front of it is so ugly. So this, fun fact, it's called a hard front where, as you can see here, this is literal fabric, which means you really can't like, you have to wear the hair down to cover it because it's not giving hair line. Whereas this is called a lace front wig. This material right here is called a lace and it's semi-transparent. So if you shove it on your forehead, it's gonna look like it's actually growing out of your scalp. This is the difference between a $2,000 wig and a $40 wig. Oh my God, but that again, we looked online when we were planning this video and a 60 inch human hair wig costs $20,000, $20,000, no! Okay, let's see, Jesus Christ. Okay, here goes nothing. Oh. Okay, it doesn't look as awful as I thought it was going to. Oh my God. Like, I, I'm like, oh. oh no. Oh my God, how do you even fucking brush your hair like this? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's stuck inside my hand. <laughs> Girl! Ew, I hate this! Ew, see, these pieces are giving like weird, like anime cosplay wig. Ooh! What's it giving? Try twerking it off. I've canceled it. Holy That's shit. Giving. Oh my god, it's like the glam vibe, like the People's Choice Awards. Instead of the fucking dress getting moved, it's like the. Cameras are always on. It's like he's signed up for. Whoa. Okay. From your head to your toes. One like on this video equals one dollar, and maybe if we get enough views, I can afford to buy the twenty thousand dollar human hair. It, it looks like a bob right now. Please, I beg you. Please give it a thumbs up. Please. You look like a horse girl. Gotta get the hair fully into the car. Make sure none of it's locked in the door. If this wig wasn't hideous, I would look so pretty right now. You guys, there are so many fucking people here. <sighs> it's literally a full parking lot. There are like no spots open. Oh no. <laughs> Pocahontas is here, everyone. <laughs> Woo! No, oh, a breezy oh, day. No, fucking thank you. Oh my God. I'm getting secondhand embarrassment. Everyone makes fun of Erwan on social media because it's expensive and stupid to be there, and it is. But the food is really good, and I know that I'm not alone in that. A lot of people go to this location. So this is gonna be even more embarrassing because the chances of seeing either a hot, rich man, a celebrity, or young girls that are my fans is extremely high. All of which put me in an awful, embarrassing scenario that I don't wanna be in. So like, this is not good. Can I please do the salmon? And then I will do the... Uh, Mac and cheese, please. This lady does not give a fuck about me or my 60 inch hair. And I love her for that, honestly. Okay, there was a few photos taken of me and everyone without my consent. And that's scary because that's gonna end up on Twitter in about four seconds. <laughs> I'm gonna be trending before the video even comes out. Coupon! I got a nice salmon and an avocado arugula salad and asparagus and mac and cheese. Shall we? I think you're starting to like it. I, I kind of look, I just look pretty. I am pretty. <laughs> Really yeah, this hair's like kind of embarrassing, but like a good wig, that will do it for me. <sighs> a really hot man just walked by and I look like this. Fuck! That could have just been my husband. Do you guys like the hair over the seat like this? Do you like? Is it giving? Yeah, no, it's, it's giving. It's giving my face. It's giving right now. <laughs> do you like? Oh my god, it's fucking terrible. Shall we? Ready for photo? Okay. <laughs> Putting it around her shoulders, crazy. Oh my god. That is insane. Oh my god, it's so nice to meet you. Good. <laughs> Hi, beautiful. How are you? I'm good. Do you like my gorgeous hair today? Yeah, it looks good. What do you think? Give me your honest thoughts. I thought it was real hair. It's nice to show me your deep brows. Really? Wow, that's crazy. That's giving. Whoa. Oh, this bro. Nice to meet you, back. Thank you so much. Okay. <laughs> We have <laughs> arrived home. That was quite the fun day we had with me and all my little wiggies, or little, big wiggies, <laughs> clearly. I honestly feel like as we do more and more of these 24 hours wearing the world's longest, insert 
random object here, it gets less embarrassing and more fun. There's literally nothing embarrassing about going out with a wig on at all. I've done it many a times. In fact, I enjoy doing it many a times as well. I feel like the only reason why I was scared today is because this is a bad wig and that's embarrassing. But even though I was a little bit scared to go out, it ended up being fine. I'm very lucky that I live in Los Angeles, a place where honestly people see all sorts of crazy shit on a daily basis. So 60 inch hair really is not <laughs> that insane. We did get a couple of stares specifically from a bunch of old men, which was weird or flattering, whatever way you want to look at it. <laughs> I saw a couple of friends, met a couple of you guys as well. And for the most part, everybody actually said that it looked really, really good. So that is our full day of wearing the world's longest wig. Oh, sick. Sorry, I, give me a hat now, please. That is our day of wearing the world's longest wig all complete. In all seriousness though, I love my wigs. I have a lot of fun playing around with them and especially in today's YouTube video, but wearing wigs is a reality for a lot of different people on a daily basis, whether they're struggling with hair loss, cancer treatments, alopecia, or so many other reasons. So in honor of today's video, I did want to make a donation to Locks of Love. It is an incredible organization that helps provide wigs for people that are dealing with hair loss and spoiler alert, they are a lot better quality than this one. So would highly recommend checking them out. If you guys have enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up down below. If you want to see us do another episode in this wearing the world's longest blank for 24 hours straight, do let me know in the comment section. If you have not already, click that subscribe button as well as the bell icon next to it so you guys never miss an upload from me. If you want to follow me on my other social media platforms, my like Instagram or TikTok or just James Charles. And if you want to check out Painted, our socials are at painted.co or you can shop at painted.co. All right, you guys, thank you for watching today's video. I love you and I will see you next time. Bye. Call me back